Hi everyone, Alex Ryan here. Today's topic is what is the hottest product to import from China? Let's get started. Welcome back everyone. So what is the hottest product to import from China? Well, simply put, there are many ways to find out the hottest product. The first way is review Amazon. Check on Amazon, see what people are selling, see what your competitors are selling, or see what the top bestseller lists are. It tells you the top best-selling industries, whether it's technology, what you know, whether it's uh, you know, um, uh, footwear, whatever industry that you wanna get into, check out the industry, check out what the best sellers are, because it will tell you the best seller uh, products on there and when you know the best seller products you could do a few things you could either import those products yourself or you could import products that support that product so for example um, for example uh, we have clients in New Zealand and in Australia who import uh, horse products so they're competing against a big company called horse land and uh, they sell a lot of really good products and my clients were like well we know the, some of the best selling products in the horse industries. Uh, we could import those, but some of those are a bit, you know, they're not that, they're a bit pricey and we've got to compete, but we can import other things like horse throws, horse blankets, horse shoes, um, uh, horse saddles. Saddles, the saddle market is huge, right? Uh, they, uh, we have people paying 150 US dollars for a saddle and they're selling it for like $800. So the market and the, the margins on saddles for horses are huge, right? There weren't, at that time, there weren't many competitors selling that. They were selling other stuff, the cheap stuff, right? The horse blankets and all that sort of stuff. But they decided to jump on that niche and they went deep with that niche. They started selling their horse blankets and the horse saddles and the horse shoes and then they started doing horse hats, you know, those little protective hats that people have. Um, uh, you know, they're, they're made of steel or something in case they fall off, all that sort of stuff. But think, whatever your niche is, whatever product you're selling, make sure you have three or four other products you can sell in addition to that product because that's where you make the most money. It's kind of like when you go to McDonald's and they say, hey, would you like fries with that, right? The ups, that's what you call an upsell. So you will have the same thing when people visit your website. All right, and if you're looking for a website, contact us because we we actually help our, our clients build websites as well. But um, when you build your website, when they go through the checkout process and they order your product, immediately after the purchase, they should say, thank you, John, or thank you, Jane, for the product purchase. Now, uh, would you also like to grab this? Would you also like to grab this saddle or this horse blanket? Uh, and you get an, a 5% discount if you purchase it right now, right? So it's an upsell. So when they buy that, they could buy other stuff, they could add it to the cart. Some people think, oh no, that's annoying, I don't wanna do that. Well, I'll tell you what, it's a strategy that works and you're helping the customer purchase those products, all right? They're gonna probably buy those products anyway, so why not do it now and they'll save money on shipping, you're actually helping them. But McDonald's do it, every fast food franchise has upsells. You look at Amazon when you buy products, right? The immediate thing on the checkout page, they're trying to sell you other related products. Even when you're searching for products, it shows you what, you know, this is what other people are looking at right now. You know, people who look at this are also looking at this. So just take that on board. These are really great marketing strategies that you can do. And so, uh, you know, when you start importing from China. So there are many ways of finding out the, you know, the hottest products to import from China. Uh, go to the Canton Fair, I'm going uh, this year. It's a great fair, you get some great ideas as well. If you're looking for someone to go with, you can always join our team uh, as well because we're usually there, we're usually over there and we help, uh, we walk, usually one-on-one, -on -one, we walk with our clients and help them negotiate and help them talk to people. But guys, uh, that's it for me. My name is Alex Ryan. If you wanna contact us, number's on the screen right there, 02 7534 We help people start importing businesses, start working for themselves giving them a much more uh, time, uh, much more time freedom, much more financial freedom and enable them to work the hours they want to do. So whether you want to fire your boss, work for yourself, work from home, if you want to start uh, your own online business, you're not too sure what to import, we help people, usually beginners and intermediate importers, start launch, start launch and uh, make their importing business thrive. We're actually looking for people right now to mentor. This is what we've been doing uh, for many years right now. I, I've been in the import game. I've started importing about eight years ago. All right, I started buying things from China, I started selling them online, and I, I've had many coaching businesses, consulting businesses. I used to do seminars around Australia, 
and New Zealand showing people how to import from China, how to choose hot products, how to basically, how to ensure the product that you import doesn't end up in a storage case in your garage for the next six months, right? We had people who who never been to our seminars before, they, but they went, they told us, well, you know what, I tried it myself without doing anything, and it's a very expensive lesson. I ended up having stock in my garage, iPhone cases, solar paneled iPhone cases, and I could not sell them for like six months, and I just wanted to park my car in the garage again. My, every time I would go down there to collect a tool or to go to a workshop, I was reminded of the fact that I can't sell those products, I can't uh, successfully sell them, all right? And he's like, I just wanna sell them, all right? We helped them sell, we actually helped him sell those products. So guys, you do not wanna import a dud, you wanna ensure that you get the right guidance and the right help with choosing your hot product. My name's Alex Ryan, guys, thanks for joining us today. I wish you the best on your importing journey. Contact us today if you want more help. My name's Alex Ryan, guys, and visit our website. We've got a free video program there. See you later.